The next few weeks are going to be a bit of a hassle at MSP. One of two general security checkpoints at Terminal 1 will be closed for approximately three weeks. The South Checkpoint near the Delta counter shut down this morning to people with a general security clearance. People who use the CLEAR program or the TSA PreCheck are the only ones who can still use the South Checkpoint. As Susan Elizabeth Littlefield explains, the shutdown is a means to an end, right, Susan Elizabeth? That's right, Amelia. You know, you hear it all the time when it comes to airport travel. Pack your patience. No exception in this case, but we're told this will be a minor inconvenience that will yield a major payoff. One after another, passengers reroute it before they even make it through security. Unless you have clear or pre-check status, the South Checkpoint is closed. General traffic is heading north. I just pray that we're able to make our flight because then those people are coming this way. It's an important flight. Her son is heading to college in Philadelphia. We're coming this way, so I hope that there's no problems over here. No problems at the North Checkpoint for these guys, but their journey will soon be arduous. They're heading to boot camp in Missouri. It's not too busy or anything, so I think it should, yeah, it's fine right now. By afternoon, lines certainly manageable at this checkpoint, but this morning the lines went all the way from that line to these spaces behind me, people waiting about 30 minutes. What we're doing is creating new automated lanes that are going to speed up the security process for people. Patrick Hogan says the four new lanes they are building and testing will have areas where people can easily take their shoes and belts off without clogging up the line. And automated belts will let you put your bag on first if the person in front of you is slower. I think people are going to be very pleased. Once they get used to using this, they're going to wish all the lanes were this way. A short term holdup, he says, will bring long term relief. I mean, we'll get through it. <laughs> <laughs> We always do, right? Well, the staff that was working the South Checkpoint is now working the North Checkpoint, so they've got extra lanes going and the same amount of staff there. Hogan doesn't expect lines to be too much longer. That's the good news there. He says that they're giving the same advice to everybody who's flying out. If that's you, get there two hours early for domestic and three for international. We just cannot escape the construction, can we, Susan Elizabeth? No Out on the highways and in the airport. All okay. around us. Thank you.